Well, Janelle, his uncles tell me that he is doing well tonight. He's still here recovering at Children's Hospital, but they say that they've already seen some improvement, which is giving them some relief after yesterday's terrifying accident. This is seven year old Periche Dahal. The little boy was hit by a pickup truck while crossing busy Route 51 in Brentwood with his mother during rush hour Thursday evening. Oh my God, when I heard that, it hurt us. Yeah, I tried to call my uncle, my aunt, and my old relative that, hey, you know, this happens. And they are all worried about these things. One of Dahal's uncles owns a clothing shop right across the street from where he was hit. He says he was shocked to find out it was him. He's a little boy. I got like little boy, uh, the same age of nine. They used to play together. Another uncle who spent the morning at Children's Hospital with Dahal's parents told me he was relieved to see him already improving. Though still using a breathing tube, he is able to move. Yesterday, the head surgery, and they found that uh, there's a little bit. Uh, blood clotted in there, so that they, they are taking out from the tube and it's improving a lot. According to police, he suffered fractures to his chest, arms and legs and remains in critical condition, but family members say it's a lot better than they expected. There was no any aspect of life. That's what I heard. But when I go to the hospital today, it's totally different. It's so, so different. The Allegheny County Homicide Unit is still investigating, so it's not clear if charges will be filed against the driver, but they do say he did not appear to be intoxicated. Witnesses say it looked like the little boy ran from his mother just before he was hit. When it happens, it's, you know, heartbroken. So hopefully, let's see, and let's pray to the guard. Now, police say they will be downloading vehicle information and also speaking with more witnesses from yesterday's accident before they decide whether or not to file charges against that driver. We're live outside of Children's Hospital tonight. Brittany Hope, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.